Hello, my name is Kaya McTeague, and today I will be talking to you about the two bombs that changed everything. They were actually the first atomic bombs ever dropped, and in 1945, on August 6th, at 8.16 a.m., the first atomic bomb ever dropped was on Hiroshima. Just three days later, the second bomb was dropped at 11.02 a.m. on Nagasaki. The president who initiated these bombs in the first place was President Harry S. Thurman. The Japanese had already bombed Pearl Harbor, and during the war, the U.S. lost thousands of men. That is why he decided to drop the atomic bombs. He wanted to end the war without risking many more lives of his own men and he wouldn't stop until he got Japan's so-called unconditional surrender. However, before the first bomb was dropped, there was a meeting held with the President of Japan. This meeting was called the post dumb Conference for Japan's ultimate surrender. Obviously, Japan did not surrender. The President had no choice but to drop the bombs. The first bomb was nicknamed Little Boy. It was three meters long and weighed four tons. When it was released, it released about 12,000 tons of TNT, and it was launched from Tinian Island at 2.45 a.m. and over Hiroshima at 8.15. The bomb exploded one minute later, 1,900 feet over a hospital. With the first few months, of the bombing, 90,000 to 166,000 people had died. Also, half the deaths in each city occurred in the first day of the bombing. This bombing wiped out 90% of the population, and this was only the beginning. This was only the first bomb. After the first bomb, you would think that the Japanese would surrender, but they didn't. And obviously, they don't know what they're coming for. After all, the president was not going to stop until their unconditional surrender. Three days later, the second bomb was dropped on Nagasaki. This bomb was nicknamed Fat Man. It was made bigger, so it was certain that the war would end. This bomb was dropped at 11.02 a.m., 1,650 feet above the city and carried about 22,000 tons of TNT. The Nagasaki atomic bomb killed 60,000 to 80,000 people. On the morning of September 2nd, after many deaths, Emperor Hirohito of Japan had declared their unconditional surrender to the U.S. Overall, the two bombs that dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki were told to be the most cruel and devastating bombs ever. They changed the world, and to this day, everyone knows who the two bombs, Little Boy and Fat Man, are. Thank you for watching.